right, so I have finished sewing. Your last step is going to be to go through and trim any of your ex excess threads that are kind of hanging off. I have pressed this once already, but I want to show you how to press again. So you're going to trim your threads and you're going to press. So um, you're going to start on the back side. So obviously this is the back side. You're going to take this to your iron, your pressing board. Um, I have a pressing board for my table. Um, so kind of lay this out and your pieces are going to kind of show, dictate to you the way they want to lay a little bit. Um, again, I'm just kind of taking all of these and I'm pressing my seams flat and I am using, um, I do have this set on a steam setting. Cottons um, tend to press nicer with steam. So I do have this set on steam. I did open up my center seams. Um, that sometimes tends to be easier. If, like, I didn't open up this seam, so that's why this one actually is getting bent. But it's the back. No one will know. So I am taking this, I've pressed all those steam seams, and I'm going to flip it over to the front, and I'm going to do one more press and make sure that there's no threads. Like right here, thread. And I'm going to press one more time. Um, the corners like here and here. Those are actually um, not the finished corners. Um, I'm not making you finish this. This is a sample um, just to practice piecing. Um, so I'm just going along each one of these um, seams. So if if the, one of these seems like it's going over the other, it's not a big deal because really um, this would be sewn at this point that's because there's the outer seam so there you go that should be your finished sample block there you go